University isn't about partying, it is about studying, but Freshers' Week is about breaking the ice. It's going to be Freshers' Week this month and many of you are going to be starting university, so I'm here with some advice for you on how to get the most out of Freshers' Week. Maybe it's not fresh week for you this year, but it is coming up in a couple of years or next year. And if you need advice for UCAS, well, feel free to ask. But my favourite place for UCAS advice is actually Primrose Kitten, who has a ebook which I think is for free, and a whole series of videos on how to go through the UCAS process. So do check those videos out. I'll put a link to that in the, in the description. I had the most amazing time at university. The first night of Freshers Week, 2004 it must have been, uh, I can remember thinking at the middle of the night, well, I don't actually know where I am. <laughs> of course I did make it home safely, and you know, Freshers Week for me was having a whole load of fun with a whole load of Americans who were over on an exchange from their universities. It was really exciting, and every little bit of advice that people gave me about Freshers Week and about university, well, it all came true. So take the advice. <laughs> I lived in the very centre of Edinburgh and I just had great fun. I had the most amazing time at university and loads of people gave me advice about Fresh Week and some of it I wish I'd followed and my brother's advice was um, just do everything, do everything on offer during Freshers Week because it, you won't get that opportunity again, you don't get another Freshers Week. So go out there with a really positive mind and really enjoy yourself. I've come to University City, maybe you recognise it. Maybe some of you are, well, not lucky enough to get in here because you'd have worked really hard if you got into this university. Maybe you're coming here, maybe not, but this is some general advice for getting the most out of Freshers' Week. If you are starting university, then perhaps stick around Guerrilla Physics because we want to give you some more general study advice. Uh, maybe then you can part of that community and you can be helping out those GCSE and A-level students that are looking to get to that same position that you've got to. Hey. So remember to get involved. University won't be like it is on Freshers' Week every single week. There are a few really important things to get done, like matriculation, so make sure that you pay attention to everything you've been told to do in your admissions letters. Be thrown into a dorm or a lecture theatre with people that you don't know yet, and you'll really have fun meeting them, I'm sure. But it's not rude to occasionally just think, well, what do I want to do? And take yourself away and go and do your own thing. Go steady. Remember, you'll be hanging around with people in Fresh Week that you might not be hanging around for the rest of your time at university, but you will see them around. So don't overdo it and don't make a kind of fool of yourself. Just pace yourself, enjoy yourself, but don't overdo it. <laughs> Some of my friends from university have nicknames that have stuck for life from Freshers Week. Don't overdo it. <laughs> university can be a bit of an opportunity to reinvent yourself, so maybe you want to get rid of a kind of reputation or something, or just want to try out a new look, new clothes then this is a great opportunity. But don't forget, although it can feel like you're a million miles away at university, you'll probably be back with those same friends hanging out in the same places, doing the same things, just around kind of Christmas time. <laughs> that first term is actually pretty short. So don't worry and make sure you keep and maintain those relationships from before university. Think about it like this, next year you'll be running the show, you'll be doing the activities that people are putting on for you for next year's Fresh Week. So learn from it and think what you're going to put on and how you're going to do it better. Get into good habits, washing your clothes, cleaning dishes, etc. Um, try not to let keeping your house become a bone of contention, but it is really important that you and those people you're living with get into some good habits and start as you mean to go on during Fresh Week. Don't let it become like, well, we're all so busy, our place is just going to become an absolute dump. There are some horror stories <laughs> that my friends have told me about their time at university, how horrendous their place has got. My place, of course, was always spotless. <laughs> It's really hard to prepare, it's really hard in your position now to know what you're going to need at university so my advice is to actually get Amazon Prime which you can get on a kind of student di um, discount, there's a link to it below which is an affiliate link but it means that for any little thing that you've kind of forgotten, any book, any last minute equipment that you need that you'll just be able to get that the next day. I'd f I would have found that really useful when I was at university. If you do come to this university of course there's always heifers for your books. Be excited, remember you're not too cool for school. When I went to university, I thought I was a little bit too cool for school. That's not the case. Get excited, get involved, join societies, 
even if you can only go to one or two things and you just join them and you never go again, at least go and find out what's out there because something in there might be your next big thing. The thing about society is it's a great way to meet people beyond your dorm and beyond your own course. So I would really recommend that you get involved, even if you only go to a few things, you're still going to meet some people who've got common interests with you and they might become those friends for life. Definitely if you've already got a big hobby, if you're already into football, skiing, or whatever, then make sure that you join that society and become a big important person in that society. Definitely if you do come to this university, bring your bike. I went to Edinburgh and you could just pretty much walk everywhere and one of the things that I did in that freshers week was just get my bearings around the city and make sure I knew exactly where all the cool things that I heard about were. I've also got a little bit of an invite for you. If you want to um, keep updated then and you want to kind of give some content to my channel, there's an open invite for a kind of uni vlog if you've just got, I don't know, a moment of inspiration, a moment you want to share, something about physics or any other subject. Maybe just something, a little bit of motivation for younger students who are maybe aiming to get to that same point in life as you. Then let me know if you've got an idea to put in together a short video, a short uni vlog um, that might be useful for people in their secondary schools now who are looking to start university like you will be this year. Maybe you've got something cool that you learned in a lecture recently and you want to do a little bit of teaching, uh, that video could be good for my channel. Maybe you just got a little bit of a storyline, a little bit of a kind of happy incident in your university life and that again could be good material for my channel. It'd be great to have some extra content in that way and for you maybe if you want to start something then you can advertise your own thing and be sure you'll get at least some exposure on my channel through my audience. I hope I've conveyed to you, you should be really excited and go ahead and have loads of fun during Freshman Week and loads of fun during your university career and come out of it feeling like you've met a lot of people, had a great time and got a great qualification that's going to get you into that career and that lifestyle that you want. What's, what's the